Hi, welcome class of 2033. It is, I'm so glad to be joining with you to talk about kindergarten coming up in the fall at St. Anastasia. I am the kindergarten teacher, Mrs. Johnson. A little bit about myself is I have a degree in elementary education, pre-kindergarten through sixth grade, and I have a minor in special education. I graduated from Concordia University in St. Paul in 2010, and I married my husband Shane in 2010, and we have two boys, Grayson, who is five, who will be in kindergarten this year in this classroom, and Landon, who is three. Uh, my interests include teaching, gardening, scrapbooking, golfing, and spending time with my friends and my family. My favorite part of teaching is watching children smile and light up when they accomplish new skills. I love using exciting and fun activities to learn. Every day in kindergarten is filled with lots of laughs and hugs, jokes, excitement for the children. And being able to share my faith and my love for God with the children is my favorite part of our school. Some of the things that we do in kindergarten, students love to work together. And we learn to work together in kindergarten. We use microscopes. We made vegetable soup and the kids got to help cut the vegetables and help make the soup and then we got to try it. Um, we worked together to decorate pumpkins. We also got to get together with first grade and decorate ornaments. Um, Goebel here in Hutch donated some Christmas ornaments for the kids to decorate and so we painted those with first grade. This year we have had saint families. Each teacher led a group. My group picked the saint name, Saint Lucy, as our saint family name. The kids got split up into groups of all different ages. They were made up from kids kindergarten all the way through sixth grade, and they stayed in that group the whole year. Some of the things that we did together is we got together to work on service projects, so we packed boxes of joy. We made cards. On occasion, we um, get to eat lunch together, and it's a great way to work together with all of the ages and get to know all of the kids in the school. Our Junior Achievement Program, we have a volunteer that comes in and teaches the kids in kindergarten about saving and spending money and about their wants and their needs. Some of the service projects that we do here at our school is we help with Box of Joy, Operation Rice Bowl, we collect food for the food shelf, and we get to go Christmas caroling. Every month, I invite preschool to come down and visit, and they get to come down and they get to see what it's like to be in our kindergarten classroom. We paint, we do group activities, we play bingo, they get to experience using the smart board, and they just get to experience what it will be like the next year in kindergarten. We have title services. This year our title services were with Mrs. Heidebrink. And then we also have speech services with um, Ms. Cruz. Library, we have our library teacher is Mrs. Heining and they get to go to library once a week and they get to check out a book and they get to listen to Mrs. Heining read stories and they get to learn about how to take care of our books. They go to computer class twice a week this year, their computers were their Chromebooks. Each child gets their own Chromebook to use at school, and they start learning how to turn on the Chromebooks, how to care for the Chromebooks, how to navigate using the Chromebooks. They use educational sites. Um, they get to figure out how to use the space bar and back, backspace and enter keys. They learn where the uh, numbers and the letter keys are, the beginning of keyboard, and they learn how to print things and how to use some internet websites. Phi Ed, they get to go to three times a week and they learn their fine motor skills, some large motor, motor skills, um, knowledge of basic rules and games, um, playing as a team, working together. Um, when it's nice, they get to go outside and otherwise they get to do that in the gym. Spanish class, we get to go to twice a week and they learn lots of different things in Spanish. This year that was my kids favorite 
class to go to in kindergarten. They learned how to greet people with basic greetings, some basic nouns. They learned their colors and numbers, their days of the week and their months of the year. They learned about different holidays and the different culture. And they learned how to sing different songs and they used Rosetta Stone. Music class, they go to twice a week as well. And they learn how to sing a variety of songs. They learn some movements and dances with their songs, actions to songs. They get to use a lot of different instruments and they perform at the Advent program and at the Grandparents and Special Friends program. In kindergarten, I like to do lots of fun activities. One of those activities is we made gingerbread cookies. So we split into two groups this year and I had a parent come in and help and the kids got to mix, measure all the ingredients, mix all the ingredients, and then we had um, Denise in the kitchen nicely baked those cookies for us and we got to enjoy them for a snack. We have our Advent program. That's a picture from our Advent program this year. Dr. Seuss Week. I celebrate Dr. Seuss's birthday by having a Dr. Seuss Week. I read a different book each day of the week, and I do fun activities, and then the kids have to guess which book I'm reading, and we read that book. The books I did this year were The Cat in the Hat, One Fish, Two Fish, Wacky Wednesday, and Green Eggs and Ham, and the kids actually got to try Green Eggs and Ham. Grandparents and Special Friends Day, we always do some, some fun activities and they have a program. Some other things that we get to do is we get to help in the garden that we get to see out our kindergarten classroom, so that's always fun. And we have our field trips. Every year rotates in the fall between the Nelson Farm, Hempker Zoo, and Applejack's Orchard. And then we go to Stepping Stone Theater and get to watch a play and Goebbels and Hutch. We get to go and tour and see Santa and make some ornaments. We get to go to the Minnesota Zoo, the Children's Museum, and the Science Museum at the end of the year, and those rotate each year. And then kindergarten and first grade always does a walking field trip. So it's every other year rotation. One year it's the post office, the library. We go to Veterans Park for lunch, and then we get to go to Below Zero for a fun treat. And then the other year is um, we're going to visit English Orthodontics, Mid-Country Bank, the police station, and Below Zero. Catholic Schools Week. That is always such a fun week here in our school. The kids get to participate in the weekend mass to start our week off. And then there's family swimming. And we always do lots of fun activities. This year we went ice skating. We had a movie and popcorn in the afternoon. We had a beach day, and the kids loved that because we got to have picnic lunch on beach towels in the gym. And then we had a dress, we have dress up days and muffins with families. School mass, we have school mass once a week and the kids will wear uniforms on that day of the week. And each week rotates between which class is going to participate and help with mass, do all of the readings, the prayers of the faithful, help in all of that. And the kindergarten starts taking turns preparing mass starting in January. The kids love it. Snack time. In kindergarten, instead of bringing individual snacks, we just ask that you bring two items for a snack to share with the whole class. And we keep that in the cabinet and we just pick something each day. And then I send an email and include it in my weekly newsletter when we need more snack. Some additional information is the school website. Um, and later, um, closer to fall, we'll, you'll be receiving an informational letter, school supply list, um, visitation days to come and see the classroom and visit and get to know Mrs. Johnson a little bit, classroom schedule, um, show and tell. We get to do, we have show and tell in kindergarten on Fridays. So if your child wants to bring in something to share with his friends, they can do that. Um, a weekly newsletter to let you know what we're doing in all of our throughout all of our day and any additional information for you. This is just an example of my classroom schedule from this year. Thank you so much.